out somewhere out western Kelowna and look at the view man look at the bike at the 360 going there's gonna be some insane footage man and the the, the good thing with Indian the Chief Tan is it's a very nimble motorcycle for the size has some cool features that I'm gonna showcase later on I'm um, just I just flew my drone here so man I'm so thankful right now at this this moment I'm so thankful for everything that has come my way I just wanna you know if there are some angels watching right now over me I just wanna say thank you something is happening and uh, we have been very lucky on this journey that we're able to do all these things get a motorbike for the day like chief tan uh, indian motorcycle which is one of the best in cruisers and fulfilling my dreams of my dad and my whoever i don't know man it's all their sacrifices that we are enjoying here i want to say thank you to my dad thank you to my wife my mom everybody like i just want to make it like a award ceremony but i just want to thank them for being by my side at my at my um, how do I say it? At my worst, and you know, making me, letting me do what I wanted to do always. Thank you, everybody, for watching mostly motor vlogs. Subscribe to this channel if you want to, and for more such awesome content. Good morning, guys. Today we are going to pick up a motorcycle. Indian motorcycle dark chief and I'm going to meet a lady she was born in India when but she moved here when she was 10 oh, I forgot the name of the rental okay uh, true north you want to give a shout out I'm recording on my blog oh, I can't <laughs> so I, I actually met up with Nicola and uh, Kelowna and she owns a rental business I'm picking up this Indian Motorcycle is called the Dark Chief Chief, Chief yeah, Ten. The Chief, Chief Ten. Ten, yeah, nice. By the way, bike is the ultimate, ultimate bike, ultimate bike. I don't know if you can hear me. This bike is ultimate. So right now, we're going to the hotel. I'm gonna load up all my shit in the car and then go for a drive, ride or something. So, our with Nikhil Bhai are here today. Nikhil bhai is a very must man in Chandigarh He is a lot of time in Kalona He is a bike paper And This is a very good bike This on here Yeah, it's Nikhil bhai, Nikhil bhai. 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 Nikhil हमारे हाथ ही इनको मैसेज कर दिया कोई हार्दिक को एक बार पूछ रहा हूँ इनको कि अगर वो कल का जेट आप तो ठीक है हाँ फिर हमारे हाथ ही तो हमारे यहाँ पार्टी कर ली और क्या और मेरे को कल का बहुत अच्छा ऐसे भी लाइक्स वो तो बार्बर शॉप गया हेयर कट लास्ट टाइम आई वाज हियर आई वाज दिस बार्बर शॉप रेड Remember we were from Toronto? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. We, I came back. Oh, you came back on the bike? No, I just rented it. Oh, it's like <laughs> what the hell? Guys, this is the farmers market, and we're gonna park somewhere here. This bike is like a car, man. Yeah, it's big. <laughs> it's fucking huge. It's huge. I'm not used to these kind of bikes. So we're at the farmers market. What's it called? Kelowna farmers market. Kelowna farmers market. So. Tell me more about Kelowna, man. <laughs> it's filled with a lot of people, honestly. Are you gonna, don't, don't say anything bad, huh? I'm gonna edit that out. I want people to move here. 
-huh. But my end goal would be to live in BC and settle in BC because yeah. definitely it's worth the mountains. Yeah. Oh yeah. Something really cool. She's about to show something really cool. Let's see. Let's um, let me be the judge of that. <laughs> Where am I not? Nice. Oh. The open also like a coffee shop but it's, it's like an, in a small trailer and i like coffee shops that are like in that's what my end goal is like i want oh just to open a coffee shop, shop yeah in a trailer it doesn't <laughs> have to be moving but it can be a coffee shop inside a trailer christmas okay let's try momos which one you're ready for oh okay nice a vegetarian banana vegetarian very dead and it's poking other. You don't have any chicken or anything? I have only vegetarian and pork. Okay. Okay. Okay, so we have... Okay. Can we we're gonna go around and come back. Okay. Getting the Irish what is the Irish coffee? Yeah, yeah, the Irish. The mocktail. Uh, so check out check out Tenebris Coffee in Kelowna. How is it? Um also so okay, second question, how expensive is it to live in Kelowna? Depends of at what stage are you moving, honestly. Like for me, I would say. Because of everyone moving here right now, the rents are definitely going up. Like, yeah. definitely. Like, also, like, if I say, like, what I am paying, mm -hmm. and then if I compare it to Toronto, I still feel like it's a lot for Kelowna price. How much are you paying? I pay fourteen fifty for a one bed. Yeah, but it's not bad because like I also live in a pet friendly apartment because mm. I have a cat. Mm. So if you want a cheaper apartment, you have options. You okay. have options for like nine hundred thousand also. Okay. But they're not pet friendly, right? I know Food like, quality? Yes, like the vegetables and then fruits and everything and I'm like, I'm eating it and I'm like, okay, this tastes nice. Yes. This tastes so good. I don't know why. Nice. Is it, it is, it, I don't know what it is about or what is making it taste so nice, but definitely. I, I think, think it's probably because like everything. The water, man. The water here is different. Yes. I mean, it's all because of like, I think everything that's been like using local stuff. Mm -hmm. And then everything's locally grown. This is one of the best parts. BC, like yeah. you know, sometimes you don't need to eat organic stuff. You can yeah. eat local stuff and be healthy. It's not yeah. like organic seasonal, stuff. yeah, seasonal yeah, stuff. Exactly. Like you need to know what what are you eating basically. This is called the Anarchy Coffee. Yeah, man. Uh, so Charisma is on her third coffee of the day. So we're here at the farmers market, and then. She's just gonna finish her coffee and we're gonna leave. It was Charisma and uh, she took me around for a little bit and then I will. She's going to work right now and uh, she's a friend of mine. Cousins, my cousin's actually batchmate. I want to tell you one thing. If this bike is in India, then there are six people in the car. Splendor, there are four people in the car. Eight. Four. Bike. Anyways, I'm gonna 
sign out from Kelowna. Today has been a great day. I got a little bit of ride in me. Like, so I'm just gonna keep going and keep recording. Peace out. Nisha must be rather here. Then the live shoot is here. And I'm here. So enjoy your life. Uh, don't worry about what people are gonna say, what people are gonna do. They're gonna say shit all the time, anyways. Make sure you go out there and give it your best and enjoy this whatever of the life you have left. So make sure you get up today and plan, do whatever it takes for you to create your dream, dream life. Because you know, on along the way, you're gonna have a lot of people not gonna believe in you. But trust me, when you take that first step, you better believe that you're gonna make it, make it. You're gonna make it, or otherwise, you're gonna figure it out that that was not for you. So either or, like you're now gonna have a life of regrets. If I never did this trip and I never picked up this motorbike, I would have never known like how beautiful Kelowna is. The whole trip, whole ride up coming here was insane, man. Anyways, peace out. Thank you for watching Mostly Motor Vlogs. Signing out. For more videos. This is just the beginning. We're halfway, not even halfway, quarter way through our journey. So there's more where this came from. Peace out.